Hello everyone. My name is Hosanna Basra. I am at International School and today I am going to do Activity 26 Science Magic. So my first experiment is Pepper Dispersion Experiment. So the material required for this experiment is one glass of water, one plate, grounded black pepper and some dish washing soap. So first we will take our plate and place it on the table and pour some water in it. And then we will take our pepper and sprinkle a fire layer like this. All once the pepper, uh, the water nice and evenly, we can see the pepper sits on the surface of the water. Now dip your finger. Nothing much happens. Only some pepper stick to a finger. Now take some dishwashing soap on your fingertip and dip it in the water. Wow, the pepper seems to magically shoot away. Hmm. How does it happen? Let me tell you the principle behind it. Why pepper floats on the top? Pepper is hydrophobic, means water is not attractive to it. And because of that, pepper cannot dissolve in water and floats on the top. Why pepper shoots suicide when soap touches the water? Soap is able to break down the surface tension of the water. As soap moves into the water, the surface tension changes and the pepper no longer floats on the top. But the water molecules still want the surface tension going. So they pull back from the soap and carries the paper along with them. Thank you. My second experiment is drying floating in water. So the material required for this experiment is one glass of water, one syringe, one plate and one dry erase mark. So first we take a plate and place it on the table and take a dry erase marker and draw anything like figures, letters, shapes, Animals, anything you would want. Now, let it dry for some time. Now, take your syringe and fill it up. And pour some water carefully and slowly close to your edges of your drawing. You should see that your drawing should lift off the plate and float around like this. See? Wow! You can try this experiment with different shapes and colors. Thank you. Third experiment is warm balloon without bursting. So the material required for this experiment is one lighter, one candle, Two inflated round balloons, one with water and one without water. So first, we will take a candle and place it on the table and from a lighter we will light it up.
Now we'll take our inflated balloon without water and place it 30 to 35 centimeter above the flame and slowly bring it down. Now we will light it again. Now we will take a second inflated balloon with water and as before and slowly bring it down. Wow, it doesn't pop. Now let, let touch it to the flame. Wow, it not pop rather. You can see, it will leave a soothing mark on the balloon. Like this, see? Hmm, I love this experiment the most. Thank you.